I'd like to invite this to the stage Muna Abdi. <laughs> Christian Nuchiri. <laughs> Anais Mutarambari. Ori Lawrence. And Malik West. Now, very, very briefly, if you could just tell us a little bit about yourselves. I'd just like to say it's a real pleasure to be here tonight. Um, my name is Ori Lawrence. I studied a BTEC in Sports Studies at Matthew Bowen College and achieved a distinction in all 18 modules. Um, that was whilst I was training as a junior athlete, winning the Midlands County Outdoor Championship, the West Midlands Indoor Championship, and becoming the England Silver Medalist. Um, at the moment, I'm studying Sport and Exercise Science. <laughs> yeah, I'm studying Sport and Exercise Science at the University of Birmingham and um, I've recently become elected as a second year rep. Um, I'm on track for a decent degree, I like to think. Mm -hmm. And um, I've recently become the British Taekwondo champion. I'd like to say a great thank you to my family over there. None of this would be impossible without the support structure, especially for my mum, Lorraine Lawrence Taylor, my dad, Danny Lawrence, my big brother, Aidan Lawrence. And um, I'd just like to say, keep chasing your dreams and um, with great hard work comes success. Thank you. My name is Anise Mutaram Bidgwa and um, I came to this country seven years ago and when I was in year four I was like the quiet girl at the back who really didn't say much because I really couldn't speak English but um, um, I was able to kind of overcome that, learn English and move on to secondary school at St. Catharines which was like the best school I've ever gone to and um, I was able to take my GCSE and achieve 11 A stars and three A's. And, That wouldn't, poss wouldn't be possible without all the teachers at St. Catharines who helped me through all the times where I, I started breaking down when I was doing my ICT coursework, doing my textiles coursework, doing my English coursework. And um, i just like to thank them and my family for helping me through everything. Hi. Hi, my name is Muna Abdi. And uh, I want to thank especially Miss Fearon from my school who nominated me for this award. She nominated me the, the final week before the nomination ended because she thought that I d deserved this award and thank you very much. Um, also, I, I've done stuff in schools such as the Black People's Achievement Program for Somali girls. Um, I was seen as dyslexic in year 10 and I was getting D's in English and I came out with two A's. Um, <laughs> So, um, also, I was supposed to be getting um, about 11 C's and I came out with two A stars, two A's, four B, four, um, four A's and four B. So, yeah, <laughs> thanks. Um, um, thanks to my school and thank you to Spiron again and her department, which I help out with, um, which is for students that come from overbrook overboard uh, abroad um, who don't understand it, um, have much English and I'm a mentor and a mentor year nines and year elevens and international students so thanks. All right, um, first of all I'd like to say that I'm honoured to share the stage with all the performers, role models and um, award winners today. It's been inspiring to just be here. Um, I'd like to thank my teacher, Miss Boy, for nominating me for the award. I think I got this award because I got my A stars, three A's at GCSEs. Um, I also compete at uh, parity level in football and high jump athletics. Um, if you look at me, you're going to think I also play the saxophone and the oboe. Um, uh, I've had a 
had a successful clothing line uh, which brought me in to create a youth magazine which helps create a voice for young people in Barnet. Um, your hire back there helped create that as well. Um, I think that's helped me see that it's not all about personal success, um, it's about helping the wider community, which is what the ASS do. Um, and basically, I'm just happy that I've been relatively successful and been able to do the stuff that I like to do as well. So put your hands together, they're all fantastic winners. But the winner of the 2011 Diamond Ball Award is Christian Nuccheri. Thank you very much.